your contract is you got that from you. You've never asked. Hmm. Well, thank you! Oh, that hurt my throat so badly. Oh! <laughs> I felt like a scorpion just went down my throat wearing a toupee. Okay, uh, first of all, why the fuck do you have a scorpion in your throat and why would you be wearing a toupee? What scenario does that ever occur? You have a scorpion in your throat wearing a toupee. You lose a bed or something? Yeah, I use a new you medical. Your... Yeah, uh... I need to buy a scorpion. Okay, what for? For a pet? No, I need to eat it. <laughs> it, 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 it. I think it'll cure my. I I have a sore throat. <laughs> I think it'll fix it. Like, going over to like Petco or something. You have a scorpion I can eat. You <laughs> <laughs> like a damn you think they'd sell it? <laughs> now, how, how long do I have to cook this thing? <laughs> should, should it be oven roasted or should I do it on the grill? <laughs> it, if I, if I put it in the oven, uh, what, what temperature should I do it on? Should I do like 350, 250? Maybe have my mom put on a toupee? Yeah, someone I mean, gets like, someone gets like a dog. It's like, alright, so how long should I cook this thing? <laughs> Here's the funny thing, if you're going to go get Scorpion, after you do that, you have to go to a wig shop and explain to them, you have a toupee, the preferably Scorpion size. I don't even know how the workers would react to that, I don't think there's any way to react to anyone going to your store and saying, can I have a toupee, Scorpion size. I forgot what question it was, but it's like, what do you do if you're behind a biker? And I think one of the answers were, frantically wave your arms and honk your horn to alert them of your presence. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know how waving your arm is going to help you. At least David doesn't want to eat race sight. Oh, yeah, that's a good hazard. I just stay out of my swamp. Leave my friends alone. Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> How did you find that guy in the first place? <laughs> the things you've had to Google to so find this him guy. On uh oh, he was recommended first I was for like, you. What the fuck is this? He was just like Shrek. He's screaming. Like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> then he finally found him. Found him, and he's on YouTube because he makes vlogs. You gotta wonder, I wanna know more about this guy. What is his daily routine like if he does oh, video? He wakes oh, up. Ah. Is this his job? Is this what he gets paid for to do? Just put I don't know. creepy ass yeah. maps of celebrities and characters and just start screaming? He's a pretty popular vine. Oh, well, it's pretty popular vines. I can, I understand why he's popular because he's so batshit crazy. <laughs> What if he actually has a mental issue while just laughing at him? <laughs> Think about it. It's pretty dang creepy though. We look at this stuff, we'll do like different days. We'll be like, today is something day, and then she starts screaming. I legit think that guy may have a mental issue. Considering I've only seen a couple of his videos, I don't want to return. But I've seen that he cut a hole in SpongeBob's mouth and starts sticking his tongue through. That creeps me the fuck out. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Something uh, about. It was, one he was it was one where he was dressed like a minion. Okay. He won't see the strip, though. Dress? Okay, let me just. So, all we'll you told me so far. Far. This is all information you told me so far. He, so, I had to do a handcuff. Him dressed as a minion and screaming. <laughs> That's uh, all the information I've been given so far. What do you think I'm interpreting that as? He actually, he actually wasn't dressed like a minion in the handcuff, in the handcuff one. We just explained it up in the handcuff one. And had to do with Sandy. Where does come in? Who does the scrap this guy? Today's sand building day. Ah! Yeah, be sure, be sure to give me some love. You go. Look up right side. You sort of remind me of the creepy guys that your mom warns you about not to take candy from as well. Yeah. 
It just has like a sense of creepiness. Yeah, yeah. a little bit. The left's just a, just a tad at. I can already drive perfectly fine. I drove around a parking lot. I mean, this fun. Yeah. I I drove behind uh, the price shopper. So, yeah. That was bef yeah. that was after I crashed the car into a garage. Yeah. Also, I oh, I have that lawnmower, so basically I can train on a lawnmower. A lawnmower, <laughs> lawnmower and a car are pretty different. I understand, but no, I like lawnmower is a good blast. starting air. It, it, it's more of like a starting edge because my my lawnmower is like a car. <laughs> yeah, you know, the engines are exactly the same. They both run on like the same exact engines. They run on the same gas. They all go 60 miles per hour on average, flying in and out of traffic of other one. Lawnmowers. My lawnmower goes about 15 miles per hour. Okay, good luck with that when you're on the highway with people usually going 60 to 70. Good luck. I don't think I'm ready for the highway yet. Did you manage him on the highway? Alright! <laughs> 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 he's got a trailer hooked up. Trailing cars behind him. <laughs> There's like no one in front of him because they all pass by him. You just see me like with a, like a, a racing helmet. 